trick to keep this in the middle so that way uh, it's not like super hot or super cold when you want to make adjustments. I've literally taken grass my whole life. So, I'll do a recap what happened last night. Um, I spent 20 bucks at the casino in Roulette to see if I could take 20 bucks and make money out of it and then just cash out. And I think that's the only way to really gamble, um, especially on like the machines, is just you put like 10 or 20 bucks in and see if it turns into more and then just cash out when it's like a little bit more and walk away. Oh, but yeah, I lost 20 bucks. So every week I have progressively lost less than the casino. I lost, uh, I started, I lost 350 with the strategy. I started putting 50 bucks in every time. Then uh, I played the strategy, the same kind of strategy more conservatively. And I lost my money like slower. I lost like 150 bucks last, last week. And then this week, I lost 20 bucks. And then I also requested special services uh, from certain women. And the whole situation just fucking turned me off from the whole fucking thing. It made me so fucking mad. Like, like, just, like, the amount of, like, time and energy, like... You can't like network with these like types of like situations because there's like they're just cut off. There's just like metal men um, involved and like yeah, I mean you don't know these things, so you like learn it. Um, yeah, so like all the time I was spending thinking I was networking, I wasn't really networking. Um, it's like the least personal, most fake thing you can like imagine, um, and. There's like all these like extra fucking fees that you don't expect, um, and it's just like completely bullshit. Like it's just bullshit, and it makes me think that the porn industry is like the same kind of thing. And I don't want to be a guinea pig in someone's fucking hamster wheel, and that's probably what it's gonna be. I'm just gonna, and I was watching YouTube videos and like between like workout stuff, and fitness stuff. Like, I, I, the last couple weeks have just got, gotten really frustrating. Um, I think I just needed to calm down and, like, work my job. And, uh, and, uh, I don't know. Like, I didn't move to the greatest part of the country for, um, uh, I don't know, for certain things. Certain things I did, for certain things I didn't. Um, uh, but in terms of, like, meeting women that, you know, expect money like that this is like the worst part of the country for that. so hopefully i can just work my job and gain experience um i don't really have uh like an addictive personality um i'm able to like step away from things if i want to it's really only if i really enjoy certain things i like to do them but um yeah i'm able to step away if I don't, if they don't, like, if it's not something that is, like, working out for me, or not something that, you know, I get enjoyment out of, then I'll, I'll just step away from it. And one thing that I've never stepped away from is marijuana, because marijuana has benefits, and it's, like, a matter of, like, how much you use it, how less you use it, and from time to time, you can't take steps away, and take breaks, and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I'm just like rethinking a lot of things. I think there's like areas in my life, like like there's like almost every area I can improve on a little bit. Um, and I don't need to sell myself short when I know what I can do. Um, you know, like if I if I did porn, I the way I would do think I could do things like ah. Uh, Say, like, I've seen very few people in porn that can do the things that I can do. I'll say that. But, yeah. I just need to, like, not let dumb people get the best of me. That's, like, basically 
just med- if I meditate more, if I run more, if I read. I said this, I said this yesterday. Meditate, uh, run, and read. I think if I do those three things, I will be able to focus more and be a lot more calm and relax and see things from a more clear perspective. I'm sure. Meditate, read, run. Or meditate, run, read. I don't know. Meditate, read, run. That sounds good. Yeah, those are three things in my life that if I did every day, I would, uh, like, they would just drastically improve my life. If I, if I meditated for 15 minutes every day, if I read for 15 minutes every day, if I ran for 15 minutes every day, I would, my life would drastically improve. <laughs> You know, uh, there's different things I can do. Um, I mean, having money saved up definitely helps. Um, being able to do like certain things all the time. And that's kind of, I mean, that's like the aspect, the mentality I would have if I was like trying to date. Um, and that wasn't my mindset. I was like, I'm going to do this. Well, because my problem is. Like, I'm chasing when I feel like I shouldn't have to chase. Like, it's because of my height. And I'm able to do things that people aren't able to do just because, you know, even though I'm short and I can't, like, show that to people. I don't see it until after the fact. Um, But, like, I am able to show off certain things that I can do. Uh, You know, if I do more, like, calisthenics, more plyometrics, more strength training, um, you know, I'm able to show off certain things, and, you know, if I just carry myself differently, dress differently, act differently, um, you know, I'll start seeing the things that I, just for me, certain things are, are, can be extremely frustrating, but if I, if I meditate, if I run, if I read, if I'm able to, be relaxed and focused and see things from a clear perspective and just see, you know, when people are being dumb, they're being dumb. Um, you know, I could do MMA. I could get into MMA. A lot, like, people think that I, like, for some reason can't fight, but I'm very good at fighting. It is, like, one of my best skills. If, if I'm good at engineering, I'm great at fighting. Let's put that, put those into perspective. Good at engineering, great at fighting. So, yeah, that's, that's like, if I'm ranking, like, skills of mine, that, that's where my skills fall. <laughs> fighting is definitely above engineering. <laughs> um, but, you know, I don't know. Like, everybody has different skills, and they're better at certain skills and worse at different skills. Um. Like, my natural rhythm, my natural, like, 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 my body, I'm like, I don't know. Just like a physically gifted person in certain ways. And because I talk, like, politely, it's not easy to see. It's just, like, the dumbest thing to me. <laughs> I, it's just stupid. I think it's just a matter of like the guys like people we have certain fucking needs um and the way that this society is that it doesn't it doesn't do a good job of meeting those needs for all of its citizens like it's like I don't know I don't even know if there's like any one like source or like thing uh, the dating apps are definitely like a f- interesting I don't know. I 
and there's like generational changes and shifts and being someone who's older and looks younger you know I'm able to like there's different generational gaps that like I pay attention to and I don't even know I think I just need to like chill and take the good with the bad and there's just been you know things can just be frustrating You know, I think I was trying different shortcuts that were like, you know, there were certain things in this area that are only in this area. It's, it's like a mix of like holiday, stressful year, um, you know, just certain things that I wanted to learn more about and wanted to see if they could be shortcut avenues. I mean, one, one was for, like, certain attention and exposure more than anything, not for making money. The other one was for, like, a side way to make money when I wasn't working, you know. But just not, you know. I said, I did come to the conclusion that there, there are things I'm either going to want to continue to do or they're not, and that's, that's what it is. Um before that, you know, I was training, but with a job like this, I have to see, I have to see, like, if I don't do this once a week, um, you know, drink and gamble and go to a casino, it definitely impacts your training schedule, um, even once a week, um, with the job I have and the other job, you know, um, can I have a good consistent schedule where I'm finding good enough progression to pursue? Because there's different things. There's different competitive leagues. There's 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 ones that pick apart aspects of MMA for certain things like boxing, kickboxing, jiu-jitsu. Um, there's a lot of different routes and I can, I can either focus on my weaknesses or I can focus on my strengths. Um, and you know, I don't know. I can just get into a gym and see, I think if I just get into a gym and like, who the fuck is this person? What is I think is going to happen. And like another point I'll say is like the the two women I met last night were not like they didn't have as much potential as other women and they weren't like creatively inclined with like as much with like different hobbies probably or like different aspects of life as much as like I would like to be like it was just like I don't know like, that's a rabbit hole that is, like, very superficial and cold and fake. And... It's, like, kind of those things, like, that happen in college um, and after college when I, like, hung around New Paltz all the time and, like, Marist. Um, just, you're in that atmosphere and women are horny and they're drunk and like they basically dictate what happens and they fill those needs and like and then it's a matter of them like choosing who they fucking like give shit away to and who they make work for shit and like that's that's where my frustrations a lot like that is where I'm like I got uh, like, yeah, I was like, if you only knew, like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't waste so much time and fucking money.
I think that's kind of... But at the same time, like, I'd probably just be wasting my time anyway because... Like, I provide adventures with the right setup, like, with my job and money, and, like, like, uh, my, that's why I tried to, like, make passive income on the road, because it would feed adventurous setup. Well, like, at the same time, I don't know. Being on the road all the time isn't ideal either. I, I like it good. Like having a, a stable um, location where you can kind of like go to the gym and do things regularly, but yet plan, you know, outdoor excursions. It's, it's not an easy thing. It's just not. And there's, like, different ways to do it. There's different ways to be, like, remote with work and the gym and, you know, and, like, being around people, too. Like, when you travel um, remotely, a lot of the times you're, like, hours and hours from people and stuff like that. It's just, like people who choose to live that, live that permanently and they become isolated for extended periods of time. And then, like, that's another aspect of it too. And like relative, like it's all relative, you know. Um, some people are just not, they don't like the city, they don't like being around people all the time. And, so, and like for some reason I can kind of, I can kind of see both aspects of it now. Like losing social skills and gaining them back, um, and now I'm in a situation where like I really don't like the amount of. But like, if I go to the gym, if I run, if I meditate, like, and like the job that I have, like I do enjoy certain aspects of interacting, greeting people who are traveling, and doing like cool, unique things, uh, and like going to different events, and you know whether. You know, they're traveling for business or pleasure, emergency or different things. It's just interesting. Like, I want to write books, and it's definitely a good foundation for that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, like, all these other things that I want to, like, do and all these other goals I have for this year. Like, I, if I got into certain rabbit holes, like, it, I wouldn't be able to do those as well. Um, even just having a job cuts off my creative energy, my creative focus, uh, and like just time, just creates creative time. Um, I'm gonna cut this. I really don't like having like videos that just kill my phone. I just like destroy my phone memory. And usage ability um, I one fucking minute it sucks